tourists loading up in the car here. <laughs> the windy beach. Check Elias. Hi Elias. You carrying a beach here? Toddlers, you just have to have stuff for them. Devices. <laughs> yeah, big boy. Look at that. 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 Yeah. We had a snack bag. Yeah. Yeah, babe. Here you go. Mommy right behind you.
Du har lärt dem gå i jätteck även när han hade på en disvum där på fem. You put on sunscreen? Huh? You put on sunscreen? Yeah. This reminds me of Manzanella Beach. Kabul.
a quick break from swimming to come eat some fruits, fresh fruits. strawberries like full up to the brim and Cruz ate all of it well nearly all check this out the strawberry mountain do you feel like entering that the beach itself feeling like mandanala or mayaru hip up Check Elliot. He loves it. Way, Cruz. I have videos though. Back. So, Kevin's gonna bubble a curry chicken. Look how he looking like a lobster, red. <laughs> After the beach, everybody just tired, and this is some dough for some bus up shot. And tell me how you do in your curry slurry. It's gonna be just we're using apties today because, well, that is my favorite right now. A little bit of ground jira, a little bit of turmeric. Or saffron as you see in Trinidad and that's it. There's one chicken we're doing, we don't need a lot of powder. And I don't believe in frying this in oil because if you step away for a minute, it will burn and it won't be good. So add some water, stir it up and then this is ready for the pot. Alright, so this is the apties that I was telling you about. Mm. This is our favorite right now. But they only sell it in Barnes. It's just like, like a local Trini family who, mm. who does it. And her daughters live here in Houston. Yeah. So we have a half an onion here. No, you had it too, not a different from ours. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 
Yeah, no, we want it is work with the pressure yeah, thing. Yeah, I so yeah, I use the red knob to raise the lower. Get that better. After the car filet is onion. You know, put in garlic, because no. they're seasoned no. with garlic. The seasoning has garlic in it. And pepper? Yeah. So, why would you put season, why would you put garlic in the pot to chunk it when you already grind garlic in your seasoning? That okay. don't make sense to me. I don't see people doing it, but... I just do it. To me, it's redundant. All right. So, curry mixture time. As you can see, the pot is hot. Now, as I said before, all you know the deal. When it comes to making a, a paste, you wait for this water to evaporate. Curry will turn into a paste. And once the oil separates from the curry itself, that's when you know it's ready for the meat. Well, what a lot of people don't know about curry is that the spices roast it already. So they roast it and then grind it. We try it both ways, like throwing the dry curry in the oil and then this way, and this way this tastes much better. And even if it doesn't taste better, it's more foolproof. So for people who don't cook regularly, this is the best way for them to do it. Smell that aptis. I like the color. I wonder if you could get it in New York. Probably nah. no. You can. You mm -hmm. sure? Sing they have it on Amazon. Habits. They have it on Amazon. That's the only thing. Oh, if they have it on Amazon, then we can buy it from there. Are you going to tell me? It's coming that? straight from Houston. Nelly need them. Oh, for real? So yeah. why don't we buy it directly from them? We could. So you see how the car you know it's dried on. Yeah, the curry dried on, and as you can see, okay, it's thickened. It's okay. Dan is the boiled guy, the chicken guy. That's okay if your curry stick, as long as it doesn't burn. Because once you throw that meat in there, it will deglaze the pot, and everything will come off. So not a problem. Do you like light curry or thick curry? Mm. Light. Light? Yeah. Light. Yeah. Like a goat. Yeah, the goat thicker, yeah. But the chicken, like a lighter curry. So you want to explain what you're going to do now? Put a bunge down? Yeah, so basically now the, we have the chicken frying in that curry. <laughs> We just let it um, cook down a little bit. Hopefully, the water inside will spring to come out. We want that water to evaporate. That's the first water. That is the water that you do not want to eat. Once that has evaporated, we will add a second serving of water, hopefully with a little bit of seasoning in that water. And we will cook that down for the final push. Keep it, keep it covered. Right. All right. So the first water has 
boiled out, so we just added the second water to this. Now we're gonna let this bungee down a little bit more. And once it gets a little bit lower and everything looking good, we'll taste it for salt. Right, so this second water has cooked down and we are pretty much done. Look at that, nice thick sauce. And we're ready to turn this off now. green onion or size and leti to finish it up and we have our sub shot lawyers there this is cruise worship and selena statue in the opposite direction That's how good the food was. Mm -hmm. Plate empty. <laughs> so Tracy had her tea and curry chicken. I'm having basmati rice that Dan made with some nice cardamom and stuff. Some, uh, some dal and some of Kevin's curry chicken and some pepper sauce from the Chinese that we made two days ago. Yes, or was that yesterday? I can't keep track of these, but this lotion, I had to go in with my hand <laughs> to eat this. And look at the tablecloth. Tracy put this out. Bring on birthday plate. Put candles on the cake. Put happy birthday. So she insists that we cut this cake tonight. So we're gonna get some nice chocolate cake to eat. You wanna sit here, Auntie? I hope the smoke alarm doesn't go off. You gonna help Auntie? This cake rich. Mm -hmm. What's the name I did? Mm -hmm. Six layer chocolate cake. Mm -hmm. Six layer? Yeah. You like the cake, Elliot? Yeah. Is it yummy? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he liked the little um, pieces of chocolate on the side. He not interested in the cake at all, only the chocolate. 
Thank you so so much. So we so we are at ATB. So let's get some groceries. So the AGB is a little bit different. Mangoes, 98 cents. Corn is five for a dollar. Okay. You want to choose some, Kevin? and choosing some corn to make corn soup. You're not gonna like break it up and check it. Like how people just do it. No, it's Check Elliot. Hi. Look at this, Trinidad Scorpion. Wow. You should on your one. Look at that ghost pepper. Look at this big salad in here. Look like I have a chocolate. Oh, get one now. Like this? Yeah. And a yellow scotch bar. Thai peppers. We don't need that one. But then you don't need to mix salad in here because we have, um, unless yeah. of this seed, you think this will grow? No, but if I, I, if I, I want, keep this but I want the seeds from this. Oh, okay. Okay. That's the idea they only have. They have Trinidad Scorpion. So Blue milk. Maybe they have one for down here. Check this out. Here. Holy deadly snakes and that stuff. Look, this whole section here. Who's being bad? You see that little baby? So, for the condiments, we have lettuce, cucumber, freshly cut pineapple, Cabbage, we have some red onion and fresh tomatoes, freshly made bake. A little bit of cilantro here in case somebody wants a little extra kick. We have freshly made garlic sauce. And for pepper, we're gonna be using Bertie's. And the star of the show, Is right here. This is the store. Yes, sweetened bacon shrimp today. While Rashmi is in the garage bubbling a pot of corn soup. So, this is gonna be the spread. So, this is what we're eating right now. And then maybe after a couple of drinks, we'll have some corn soup. We have Dan making pina colada here. Man, I feel like I'm really on vacation. <laughs> so that is what we're gonna be. Let's take a walk outside and see what's going on out here uh -oh. Make a jungle and if you want stand up and the fork as the steam the fork of the thing yeah it already did Things 
inside to have a little bit of extra. You're just for the corn last. Yeah. I find one of the corn, the corn, the corn plays on that, the dumpling, the dumpling, the dumpling, the dumpling, the dumpling. But you can do it however you want. It don't matter. Sometimes that's for the corn first, so it just depends. But I'll put the corn now and I have more dumpling, so I'll have some more water. More corn. We're using Texas sweet corn. If you know, you know. <laughs> and right out the road by Tracy, I have corn fields. So you know the corn here fresh. We sent Tracy out last night to pick this corn. <laughs> well, to see some other people corn. We have fresh seasoning here, green seasoning. Finish it up with a little bit. I got some water for this. Right. I'm gonna cut some more dumpling on right. Dan is here. Finally. <laughs> Getting the cutting into that bake. You don't want anything else? A spoon. Spoon, please. Alright. Yeah, the banana sauce and the garlic sauce is all in one. Trust me, when you taste it, you're gonna be like, damn, that 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 is fire. So I like plenty sauce. Uh, as usual, a normal Trini likes plenty sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that should be... Pepper? I'll try without the pepper. Okay. And then... I'm sorry, I'm guessing. Mm. Now we're ready for the reaction. Mm -hmm. Messi, you don't want to show. Mm -hmm. How that tasting? Is it lashing? It's good. We could sell? Guys, so long. It is a guy, so long. For those who are wondering, we do sell. <laughs> <laughs> That was good. Mm -hmm. Now we need to cut the sauce. How that garlic sauce is in? It's good. It have a nice kick to it, right? Yeah, it is. So, I wanted to taste a little bit of the sauce. All right. Full circle. That is it. Full circle. If it wasn't married, you put Rishmi in house, right? No. Kevin Eaton. Sometimes I just wonder why I'm married, but now I know why. <laughs> oh, what are you putting in yours, Kevin? I put cabbage, red onion, lettuce, cucumber, garlic sauce, and pepper. 
Cruzan Elliot going outside just now. It's a play water fight. Bursting with flavors. You feel like you're down by Maracas? I am. But you're actually in Corpus Christi. <laughs> <laughs> Corpus Christi. Maracas comes to Corpus Christi. <laughs> You want to sit with Chris? You want to sit by Chris? He kicked his out. Daddy! 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 This really lasts all night. Yeah, I think it's better than Moroccan. He makes it all there for this dinner. It's um, missing the chow though. Like, I forget to make the mango chow, but that's fine. Nah, that's good. Okay. A lot of stuff. <laughs> I just eat it like a roti sometimes. You can't freeze this though. Huh? <laughs> you can't freeze this one. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Elliot. Careful, don't. Baby. 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 Baby.
Take a piece, eh? You have to take the old egg. No, no. Look at favorite here. and Elliot last few minutes together. Check them. Are you gonna miss your friend, Elliot? <laughs> You'll get that in the car. Mommy, come in just now. You can't get us yet. <laughs> Look at the wind turbine.
the light. Turn right onto US 77 North, South Street. That says something rehabilitation. Continue on US 77 North for 35 miles. I'm guessing because we didn't go to Lavaca, the Buckies, it took us a different route, you know, is that right? Because we should have been there, right? Yeah, you're right. Lavaca does go to a different, uh, through a different route. Not as big as the one we scheduled in Beijing. 